make sure we don't do something stupid here. Yes, come on. Okay, come on. We yeah, we'll take it. One under par. We're in contention. We need a big round two. All right, what's up, guys? Welcome back to some more EA Sports PGA Tour career mode. We're back for round two of the Masters Championship. We shot one under in the first round, which was decent considering it was our first full round on Sim in the career mode. I've done full rounds on Sim outside of it, obviously. But a good start, nonetheless, at the Masters. And we're in contention. A good second round here. We'll make the cut and uh, hopefully be in with a shot to win this thing. I've been doing my exercises every hour and a half to try and get back to real golf as soon as possible still probably a couple of months away unfortunately um but i'm i'm looking forward to the process join the gym uh went to the pool i'll be starting on the bike soon now try and get my knee as strong as possible before coming back to some light work on the golf but uh yeah looking forward to it i need my rogue energy because i'm absolutely wrecked from doing the exercises every hour and a half like it, it doesn't seem like a lot but I don't know, it's just tiring as hell, and uh, I've been wrecked these last few days. But anyway, round two at the Masters. Let's jump into this bad boy. Let's do this thing. We're playing alongside Jordan Spieth, former Masters winner. We played with a Masters winner in Hideki Matsuyama in round one, and we're playing with another Masters winner in Jordan Spieth in round two. Four to seven mile an hour wins, tournament conditions, and we're ready to rock. As you can see, I'm rocking a new t-shirt for round two. It's a bad birdie uh, polo. I th just thought it looked kind of funny, and I wanted to spice things up for round two here, but Looking forward to this. Jordan Spieth, the master's master, I would say. Huh? Huh? From the Except on that hole there. <laughs> That's awkward. All right, let's do this thing, baby. Let's bloody well do this thing. Sung JM and Scott Stallings lead the way at six under. We are five shots back at the lead, and we need a good one here if we want to be in contention. Sorry, I have my microphone in a little bit of a different position. Trying out a new thing there. Round two here at the Masters, an important day in the life. Caddy's all geared up, by the way. Played reasonably well yesterday in that first ever professional round here. Now, the goal, you'd have to think, tighten a few things up, maybe putt just a little bit better, and you'll oh, be around for the weekend in a major championship. We should be around for the weekend if we have a good round here, but Augusta can get the better of you fairly quickly. That needs to get past that. No! That's a little unlucky, if I'm being honest. That's a little unlucky, and that's going to be tough from there. Yikes, man. Jordan Speed, two under par. Well, I was hoping for the fairway. That didn't happen. Now he's in the bunker. I'm hoping he can still hit the green. Ooh, a little left for Jordan. Neither of us off to the best start. But I think I'd rather have his one. His yeah, one's actually going to be okay. I thought he was going to be underway. into the trees on the left-hand side, but he's fine. He's just fine there on the left-hand side as he starts his walk Walking up the, the fairway. Today, let's bring in Noda Begay, the Come on, third. Noda. He's got 154 yards to the front. And he clipped the tree. It did clip the tree. The oh, no, Jordan. The green. Oh, no, Jordan. Oh, that is gonna the good lie, pin. I'm just going to aim right at the pin because I do not want to take on that pin position and end up where Jordan is. Making it difficult is that enough? I feel like that'll just about get on to the front at, at worst, you know? Yeah, see? That's perfect. That's pretty much what I was going for. Middle of the green. And leave Not ourselves a long birdie putt because I didn't want to go sure and risk going field. into the bunker where Jordan Certainly was. It's tough up and down from there. Right. Just watch now. He's going to struggle to get this up onto the green, I think. Just an absolutely brutal bunker shot, to be honest. Okay. It's not horrible. That's not horrible, honestly. That's going to trickle off the green, though, is it? That's cruel. Oh, no. That's cruel. Oh, no. A mess from Jordan Spieth on the first hole. Could be double trouble. He could be looking at double trouble here. We'll see. Could be interesting indeed. All right. Jordan. Oh, my God. What's happening? Well, there's bad starts. Oh, no. What is going on here? Jordan Spieth for bogey. Please play a flop or something, Jordan. For the love of God. It's the only option you have, really. He doesn't really... He's taking his goddamn time here as well. What the f... So do the AI just not play flop shots? What's happening? No, no, no. He's stuck. What's going on? I think when the AI has like a hill in front of him, they don't know what to do. They genuinely have no idea what to do. Definitely AI having some some kinks to work out here, man. Again, just going left and... Okay, well, this is very, very strange now. Another one. You can't get it up this hill. 
We'll hit the stroke limit All right. on that one. Well, that is very strange indeed. I gotta say, that's kind of put a damper on things here. here. All right, let's... I'm gonna go with 43 foot. It is uphill quite a bit. It's breaking quite significantly from right to left, I'd say. I'm gonna go with something around there. Ooh, perfect on the backswing. It's a little, little... Okay, it's not bad. It's not horrible. It wasn't brilliant, but it's not... It's not awful. I don't think that shirt really goes with these pants, but... That's okay. That's A-OK -okay with me, man. Wow. Oh my god, we got away with the par. Holy smokes, my man. Went in the water here yesterday. I need to not do that today, okay? Genuinely didn't even know it was possible, but we're looking to get redemption here. It's redemption day! That's a beauty. Absolutely perfect. And that should leave us uh, an iron coming in with the second shot, honestly. Beautiful. Did help was playing with experienced players like Arnold Thank you. Palmer, who Thank you. Uh, you know, had Gorgeous, mate. More masters than I'd had hot dinners. Gorgeous. And, and what I did glean from them is they look left and Let's right. Let's go, short baby. Long. I think too often when Let's you're young, go, and go, baby. So dumb in this situation, you just sort of take this direct line at all. Getting kind of hot in here, boys. And then when you look at a seasoned player, they're looking. It's heating up in here. Players, Jordan Speed went from two under to one over on the very first the hole of the tournament. A destination, <laughs> not necessarily the target. Once I started to learn that, then I realized Ooh. how you could play a Augusta Bunker National, for Jordan. And the more Jordan is having just an absolute player, stinker to start the day here. Started to see an absolute the one stinker from Jordan Spieth. People that were successful around Augusta National. So a second shot, note of from the layup for Jordan. Playing from the fairway bunker at the second makes it awfully difficult to find yep, the good layup. Two, most likely Where's the pin? Oh, pin's in the center. Okay. The third. That is a tough pin position because you have to be careful. If okay, you go right of this pin, you're in trouble. You need to be very, very, very careful not to do that. You can. But it is quite significantly downhill. A good third on this par five. From I feel like 209 is still too much. I'm going to hit 198. Great chance Six to iron. This green in two, but it's a little high draw. One of the hardest shots in golf, a big towering high draw to access this left hole location. Yep, high draw. That's exactly what I've hit. I've overswung it a little bit, though, and that's short, is it? Eh, that's pretty good. I'll take that. That's an eagle putt. That's an eagle putt on two. The crowd goes wild. Doing the Mexican wave there, it looks like. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Jordan Spieth. Oh, yes, Jordan. That's an absolute beauty there. He's looking to bounce back with a birdie. Okay, let's see. Below? 1.5 degrees, so I go out like here. And then I think it does continue to turn that way, so I'll put it a little bit more out there. Um, it's slightly downhill, nothing too extreme. I'll bring it back to like 30. I'll say about three inches down. Under swingy. Nah, poor. Not enough break anyway. Oh, uh, wow. Even with the underswing, it's still way too far. Okay, it was further downhill than I thought. Further downhill than I anticipated for sure. Shouldn't be much in this. But should be good enough for a birdie. Are you sure about that? Doesn't turn no, back then? How does it turn that much yeah, coming down the hill and it doesn't turn at all going back up know, the hill? So you scumbag. That's going to be a three putt par, man. Oh. Break. That's disappointing. Jordan Speed beat us down that hole. Jordan Speed beat us on that hole. How? Put it on the green and two. Jordan Speed was still in the middle of the fairway after after three. Oh, yeah, after two, sorry. We parred that yesterday after going in the water. I hit two brilliant shots today, and, and I still walk off with a par. Jordan Spieth hitting three wood. Barely going to carry those bunkers, but it's going to be perfect now, I think. Going with the seven wood here at the lovely, short lovely hurling. Be right where you want it to be. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Jordan. I'm going for it. Full send it. Oh my god, what a drive. Come on, overswung it fast. Talk dirty to me. Get up there. Oh my god, what a oh, shot. That is a big drive. Oh, I just needed that one more ounce to get up there, that man. It's going to come all the way back down now. To this third Son game. of a bitch, dude. That was so close to getting up there and being closed. Oh, that was...
would have been an eagle putt. Back to back eagle putts nearly. I gave it my best shot there on three, but not to be, Salavi. Not to be on this day, on this beautiful day. I see clearly now. Is Jordan Spieth going to bounce back from that triple in a big way with back to back birdies potentially? He's going to give it his best shot, that's for damn sure. All right, I'm going to go for a little flop here. Not much needed to carry here for his second. Okay, wind's with me, uphill. I think it's gonna balance out. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, sit, sit. Good shot. Five foot for birdie. Gordon Spieth, oh, cruel. That's a cruel twist of fate right at the end. It just turned off for him. Yeah, we know what we have to do here. And we've done it. Good birdie. Come on, we're under par. Let's just try and avoid the silly mistakes today, and then we'll be good. You know, we'll be a okay if we can avoid those silly little mistakes in this round. And that's the uh, that's the main thing that we have to do. I feel like. So that safely in. Two thirty nine. Is this gonna carry? Four iron. I feel like just about potentially yes. I'm gonna hit a big high draw, high fade, and try to get to just sit as quickly as possible once it hits that green. Oh my god, what a shot. Hit the pin. Not a bad effort, but it was always going to be too much with the overswing there. It was just going to be hard to hold no matter what we did there. And Jordan Spieth is going to show us just how hard it is to hold. He's in 40th place now after a horrible start. Cut line's at plus one. Okay, we're safely inside the cut line as it stands currently. We just need to keep playing the way we're playing and we'll safely make that cut. No problem. Jordan Spieth playing a big giga fade as well, like myself. Not fading quite as much, though. A solid shot from Jordan Spieth. Well, it's still going to run through there. It's just a difficult hole, this one. I think it's one of the more uh, difficult holes in, uh, to hit, in the game. I think, what was it? 4, 11, and, and 17, I think, are the three tough ones that I struggle with. So if we can play those three holes level par today, I think we'll be ha on for a good round. All right, what do I do here? A little chip shot, I think, is the way. Was I this close to the green? I don't remember them being this close to the green. I'm scared. Oh, I thought it was going to go in for a second. Stop. Stop. All right. Five foot eight inches. All right. We can we can deal with that. It's it's definitely a tester back up the hill, but should be fairly straightforward. We'll see Jordan's here if he's going to smash this one straight up the hill. Yep. Straight in there. All right. So we can... Uh, we can base our putt on that, really. It's probably going to be something a little bit similar. Might even above, even, which is strange to me. Looks like the opposite, but we'll take that par. All right, we'll stay one under, two under, three shots inside the cut line, and we're only four shots off the lead. So either side of us, there's a there's a target that we're trying to beat. Six under is the... If I could be five under at the end of this round, that would be mega. That's kind of my goal right now. I think my internal goal. Because we had some silly bogeys, and I feel like if we can avoid them, we could definitely go like four or five under on sin here today. I'm going to power drive this because it's such a long hole. Such a long hole. I don't want to be dealing with a... 200 yard second shot perfect absolutely perfect it's gonna be about 180 yeah, i'd say 195 still if i didn't hit the power drive it's gonna be a long long one like watch jordan will have about 250 left like <laughs> i guarantee it because he's gonna hit like minus 10 percent on the driver and he's gonna have like 250 left bang minus seven percent Just what you want to do. Land it in the fairway. Get a little bit of roll out. Oh. That's long and left. That's actually pretty damn good from Jordan. That's pretty damn good. Fair play, Jace, Jace Bizzle. 195 into the wind. If I hit a high fade with this, I think we can stop it. That's so bad, dude. Big fast on that one. Ah! Stupid, stupid. I take my jumper off because it's bloody roasting all of a sudden and this is going to come back down to the bloody uh, front of the green here, I'd say. Come on, come on. Ain't nobody need to see all that. Where are my 100k merch, guys? Long time, uh, long time ago now, huh? And it's definitely about a foot up, at least. All day long. It's back up the slope as well. Move 43 again. And it's clearly breaking quite heavy right to left in the middle there. I'm going to say around there. Perfect. Get up. 
Not enough break. Wow. I'm getting a phone call. Hang on. Oh, no. Right, my bad. I had to take a phone call. Jordan Speed missed his putt, and uh, we're both going to tap in for par. So we'll move on to the to the sixth hole at one under par, and we're we're the same score we were for the entirety of the last round. So solid start, and uh, Jordan Speed won't be saying the same thing about his round, but still, he's not out of it yet. You know that that little mishap at the first aside, he's one under the same as me since then. Let's get some scoring done, eh? Let's make some birdies. Let's go on a run. That's how I'm feeling right now. I want to go on a little bit of a run here. You know? I want to go on a birdie run. I want to get some goddamn juices flowing. This is not an easy hole to do it on, though. I, although I usually always play this with the pin set on the right. So, going to be interesting to play with it on the left. I do feel like that will make the hole a little bit easier. All right. I'm going to come back two clubs. 172, I think, will be the one. Play a little bit of a high fade. Try to get this to stop up on the green as soon as we possibly can. Man, I'm hitting some big fasts here. Like, horribly bad tempos. Which is strange. It would have been a really good shot as well, I feel like, if it wasn't so and fast there. One. Can he do a little bit better than that and put it on the green? Let's find out. He needs a few birdies, man. He needs a few birdies big time. And that's a pull, is it? Yeah, that's a bad one. That's not great from Jordan. All right, neither of us are in position A, but I definitely, I'm definitely in position B. He's in position C. All right, so we'll take it. I'd rather be where I am, definitely. Jordan Spieth's going to have to come up and over this little ridge here, and we know the AI doesn't like coming up and over hills. Although that one is played a little bit better. It's just they always try and land it way too short. It, it, it's strange, and hopefully that, that there's a few tweaks to the AI. So I don't mind them making mistakes and, and hitting shots like that, because that wasn't a terrible shot. But, but like, when it's the situation where on the first hole there, they can't even get it up onto the green when there's that big of a hill in front of them. I mean, come on. Now the bunkers, they're just atrocious. Try chip this close. All right, it's a little bit underdone. A little bit undercooked. We've left ourselves eight for foot for par shots, now. All right, going to be a tough uh, a tough par work. putt yeah, for both of us here. Is now gonna be a grind. Let's see if Jordan can uh, can put some pressure on us here by holding this first. I mean, there won't be any pressure on us from it. There'll be pressure on us anyway. He's got it. Good putt, Jordan. He stays at level par now. I think mine's going to be a little bit below, but nothing hectic. I'm going to go something like this. Is it downhill? It's not really. It's fairly level, I would say. Fairly flat. Yes, big pot, big pot, come on. We can go a bogey-free round at Augusta on Sim. I'd be very pleased with myself. That's very, that's a very tall ass, though. I do think that. And this hole, oh, God, Pampas. We suck at this hole. Right, this time I'm aiming left, because I feel like I always go right here. That's perfect. Split the fairway. Right down the bloody middle. Can't ask for anything more than that. And when you do get a good driveway, this hole is a lot easier. It's not easy, but it's a lot easier. I think the pin is out to the right if I see it there correctly. Maybe I'm wrong. A spizzle. Always going down that right side. Like I love to do usually. And I think it'll just be okay. That's going to be A-okay. Our dark and speak. About 270, I'd say. 276. Left himself a full iron shot coming in. I don't think he'll Sitting be too pleased about that shot. Yards away. It's all about this one, though. Let's see if he's going to be pleased with this one. Okay, pin's not at the right-hand side. It's more... Oh, no! Jordan! Jordan! No! That's a cruel twist of fate, that is. It landed on the green and stopped dead and just come back, came back. Oh, that's cruel, Jordan. That's cruel. I'll, I'll give it to you. From the fairway. Back right. right, I'm gonna hit this uphill slightly. The finesse nine iron. I'm gonna come back to like 148. Please be good. I'm begging. That's not enough. It's okay. It's gonna be a better deep putt. Let's see if Jordan can put a bunker, bunker shot close. To play the third shot. Bunker to bunker? Not quite. Alright, slightly uphill. I won't say it's a foot up. It doesn't look like it's a full foot up. So we'll go 31. It's actually saying it's above. It's above at my feet, but I, I feel like it breaks more that way. Breaks to the right a little bit. I could be wrong on that. Maybe I am wrong. I'm just going to play it pretty much straight at the hole then. 
I wasn't. I wasn't wrong on that. I was correct on that. I should have stuck with my gut. I would have had a chance to hold that, I think. I might have not given it enough, but I would have had a chance. That's silly of me. We're rocking Rocket Pop with Rainbow Candy today, guys. And, uh, yeah. New Tiger's Blood Flavor on Rogue. Last month, actually, guys. You guys smashed it with the Rogue Energy Orders. That's in. Well done, Jordan. You guys smashed it. We were, I think we were just outside the top 10 of Rogue Partners for, for the month of May in terms of sales. In terms of sales from my code or whatever. Which I, I really do appreciate. I appreciate everyone uh, buying my buying Rogue with my code. It means a lot and it helps me out. And uh, yeah, I think overall, throughout the, the couple of years I've been with Rogue, we're sixth. So we are sixth. Let's, let's pump that up to number one. Huh? Let's get inside the top five at least. Crack the top five with orders. But yeah, I really, I, I can't thank you guys enough for that. It's awesome to, to see you guys enjoy it as much as I do. And every time a recurring order in it as well, um, if you're ordering more, use my code and you'll get 20% off again, you know? And uh, that really does directly support me. So I'd appreciate that. Let's see if we can uh, if we can go for this bad boy too. We need a big drive here. And that looks sublime right there. Might be a little bit off to the left, but that's going to be fine. We'll just play a little bit of a draw. I think the pin's at the yeah, back nice in round two, if I'm not mistaken. It could be mistaken, actually. We look good in that top, actually. You know? We look damn good in that top, baby. Let's go. We're nasty with it. We're not that innocent. Oh, baby, baby. Oh, Jordan's in the fairway. Ha <laughs> ha, lucky bastard. <laughs> Hit the bunker and goes uh, back up and out of the fairway and into the, uh, or back up and out of the bunker and into the fairway, rather. Jordan Speed's laying up, though. What a pussy. I mean, come on, guys. You get that kind of a break and you lay up? That's some pussy shit right there, Jordan. No, pin's actually at the front right. Or is that back right? Hard to tell from this angle. Left himself 72 yards. It was going to be a tall order from, from 278. Oh, yeah, pin's like kind of middle. Okay. Has a great chance to reach the green, but still going to have to pull off an awfully great shot, hitting it's it right to the left. Very uphill. Fit it in that narrow opening. It's fairly long. I, I, don't, I think a seven would. I think a four irons the club. I, I know it might not seem like enough, but these bad boys run for days, you know? That's not enough. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what a shot. Let's go. Eagle putt, baby. 32 yeah, foot for eagle. That's the kind of a break you need right there. We got a nice uh, a nice roll off that one. And that's a good chance. That's a second eagle putt of the day. I think we had a 30 foot for eagle last time. We, we three putted it. We're not going to do that this time, though. Jordan Spieth with a good shot there as well. And he'll leave himself six foot up the hill for birdie. Under the pin from Jordan. Smart shot. It's a big uphill putt here, though. And it's breaking hard right to left. For an eagle. I'm going to say about 45 foot. I hope that's enough. And I feel like it definitely breaks pretty significantly right to left. Nothing to the extremity. Yeah, it's more than that, is it? It was actually, yeah. It needed more juice. Wasn't getting there anyway, but... Okay. It's a, a decent putt, and we've left it's ourselves four foot now for, for birdie. For his birdie. Jordan Spieth to get to one under par. Or wait, is this to get him... Level par again? Did he just bogey? Right on line. No, That's one under. Fair play, Jordan. You're back eight. under par. So this is below, really? This one for birdie. I would have expected it to be above, considering the last, last one. But we'll take it. Birdie. Eight. Birdie for me and Jordan there. And uh, we're both two under since the second. Of course, he has the triple on the first. We're three shots back now, boys. Come on. We're in this thing. We're in this thing. We're making the cut comfortably. And we're in this thing. We're just we're just in control of our game right now. Sim or no sim, it doesn't matter. We are in control. That's what we're cooking. That's what we're cooking, baby. All right. Sorry, I got carried away. All right, ninth hole. I almost forgot what the ninth hole was for a second. It's the, of course, the two-tiered green. Bada bing, bada boom. Three-tiered green. Beauty. Beauty, sir. Yeah, that is a wonderful That's going to leave me a wedge from there. Right keep going. Indeed. Just keep on going You're down there, sir. Thank you very much. All right, we'll take a brief intermission after nine holes. Go get a hot dog and, um, and continue on the back nine. That's what these pro golfers do, right? The halfway house. I somehow don't believe it. This Gordon Speed is, is going to just about be okay there, I'd imagine. Gonna travel down the hill and leave him quite a longer second shot than mine. 
169, but still like? nothing crazy. Where's the, the pin? Let's go to Noda. Well, the good news is his ball has found the fairway, but I can't see. The left side they need the to get that pin bloody uh, play, highlighted a little more. In a big draw, though. Oh, it's up the back. The yeah, that pin position is tough, actually, up the back. But Jordan's nailed it. And he has that to get back to level par That's for the front sure. nine. Mm -hmm. He's battled Jordan back well. From the fairway. Right, I'm just going to hit the 140 full. Well, from Quite this far section uphill. of the fairway, you have an opportunity to get the ball close to the back third of this Beauty, green. Come on, be the one. It's going to require some sit. good calculations on yardage sit. and proper execution. Oh, to yeah. Get the ball to sit on come on. Me and Jordan hit two uh, beauties. Both have about 10 green. to 12 foot for birdie. 13 feet 13, away. sorry. Sorry, guys. I've let you all down. It was 12. I said 12. Jordan. For... Oh, yes. He nails it. Back to back birdies for Jordan Speed gets him. See, that's what I mean. Like, the AI plays so well apart from that first hole there. Like, the AI is playing really nicely and realistically for a lot of the a lot of the game, but then it's just like one random stupid hole will kind of ruin the immersion. All right, let's see. It's turned a lot. It's downhill a lot. Nope. Turn more than that. It turned more than that, sir, and that's going to be a disappointing par. It was a difficult putt. Gordon Spieth, birdies, we par. And we'll move on to the back nine in a decent position, though. We've played ourselves into contention here with a two under front nine at Augusta. And we're cooking for the back nine, boys. We are cooking. Quite a few people at six under. I think three people at six under, a couple at five under as well. We're closing in on him. Camellia, here we go. Let's do it, baby. This hole's tough, though. I think a par here is a decent score always. Really? Plays harder than any other hole at Augusta. That's crazy. I thought my 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 trio of holes would, uh, would rival it. Four, 11, and 17. But nay. Got lines move to even par. All right, so no ejections. If we eject ourselves from this tournament, you never know. We can still find ourselves uh, missing the cut here. But I'm fairly confident at the moment that we're not going to do anything stupid like that. I'm feeling good about it. Looking for a strong finishing kick here on this Friday to get set up for the weekend. And that, another good drive here. Another good drive. Play a big fade again. This time, I want to... Our big draw, rather. Actually, you know what I'm going to do here? Last time it didn't work. But I'm going to do it again. Because I'm a mad bastard. Let's play the stinger. Big draw stinger. See, that's exactly why it didn't work last time. Though. It went too far right. But this time it's working. This time it's working its way back a little more. And that's going to be and absolutely like so perfect. Players, they hit it Look at that. The right side. The Genius stinger. From the wrong side of the fairway. Left ourselves a beauty there now. Very close. To the edge of the bunker that protects the right. Just a safer way to play that shot, and it still went 323 yards. We left ourselves 177. Jordan Speed has about 198, so he's about 20 yards behind us. Slightly more challenging to access. The tee shot is tough here, though, and that's why I decided to just play the little stinger. It does bring that bunker. Got a little creativity in there. That looks good, though, Jordan. That looks real nice. It's gonna be a little short, but good shot. Uphill putt for birdie for Jordan Speed from 20 foot. Wind is an extra half club, but then I feel like. Like the downhill nature of the shot balances it out nearly a little bit. Oh yeah, sit. Beauty, absolute beauty! Come on, baby, we're in contention oh, no, at the Masters. Looks... Come on, Jordan, what you got, buddy? The speed, it's uphill, not much break in it. Maybe just a touch to the left. Another one. Ooh. Oh, no, Jordan's been dealt a cruel blow there as it looked like he was going to go for another birdie. This is still a difficult putt, let me tell you something. This is no gimme. I'm going to aim outside his marker, and uh, I think this is fairly flat. Yeah, it's fairly level. I'm going to aim just a little bit more that way. No, oh, you clown! Underswung it like a dickhead. I had it right in the middle if I didn't underswing that. Oh, that's a stinger. It is a stinger. It is a stinger, though. Oh, that's a bloody nightmare, that is, mate. That's an absolute nightmare, that is. Stupid, stupid, stupid. Stupid. I am stupid. Gordon Speed makes a par. We make a par. We got eight holes left. Come on, we're, we're, doing, we're doing good still. Brings more risk to play. That's not good, Jordan. 
That's gonna be bad from there. Oh no, at least he got past the trees, but still, that's gonna be real bad from there. That's exactly what you don't want to do, for sure. We're just gonna go straight left of that. I'm gonna go a little bit further right than I would have wanted, I think, but this starting toward the right should side. get past those trees on the left-hand side there. Yeah, it's gonna be perfect now. We may have to play a punch, potentially, just to make sure we avoid those trees, but I think we're close enough to them that we won't have any overhanging branch problems. I just about think so. From the pine straw now. But we shall see, Renly. Jordan. Spizzle. My man with the hizzle. That's in the water, Jordan. You're lucky it's not, Jordan. You're lucky it's not. Good shot. And that's gonna a good shot now. Short, but... All right, let's see what we got. We got 180. It's into the wind. It's downhill. I'm, I'm thinking about playing a little low finesse here. A little 180, 179 finesse. A little bit low to keep it under the wind slightly. So good. That's go. so good. Oh my god, I'm on fire! Come on! Come on now! Just let's win the Masters! Game. We've won the players! Let's win the bloody Masters Championship! This is how we do it. Jordan Speed. Yeah. That's a good looking shot. We're still closer. And we're for birdie. That's how we do it, baby. That's how we do it. Let's go! Jordan Speed nails it for par, though. Okay. Well it keeps his hopes alive here of winning the Masters Championship. Jordan Speed does. A little bit below. This should be fairly straightforward, I would say. Not much in this. We've nailed it. Come on! Come on! Antley and Bradley not getting a 7 under either. Powering their way around. We go to the 12th, the infamous 12th, the golden bell. All right, while the wind is going right here, I'm going to hit this club. All right. That's good. That's a 26 foot putt for birdie. It's not amazing, but it's a, it's a good shot. It's a safe shot. It's not in the water. It's not a Jordan Spieth. Let's see if Jordan Spieth pulls a Jordan Spieth, though. This is going to be very interesting indeed. Jordan Special. Oh, that looks good. That looks good. Jordan Speed with a beauty. It's a dart yeah, at the 12th for Jordan. Right you really got to trust the fact you've banked the practice. You trust it's fairly the straight, this, you know. And certainly trust the line. All right, let's go with it. Roll with it. Over swinging fast. That's not a great putt, you know. Not a great putt at all. I don't think we gave her enough break anyway, but it was a bad putt. Five Jordan Speed to get to three under and tie us, actually. No, we're four under, sorry. Jordan Speed to get within one of us and within three of the lead. And he obliges. No, he doesn't. It's cruel. It turns too much. He's there to tell you he doesn't care. All right. No missteps there. It is a par. par here at 12. Ogie free still, guys. And this is the most scorable part of the course now. Two par fives in the next three. If we could come out of these par fives, we, we could come out of these par fives leading the tournament. Honestly, uh, I, I think we could. Birdie the two par fives, par the par four, and uh, oh my god. Oh no. Okay, AI needs a patch. I mean, guys, what the fuck. So, a tough hole. It's okay, for oh, I'm going for this in two big green. style. I'm going to hit a big the slinging draw here. Behind. I hit a big slinging draw here, and we're going to put it close with the second. Oh, just draw around there for me. You big beauty. Oh, it's so good. It's so, so good. For a well done, my son. Well done, Jet my son. The thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. you got anything of value for us? Anything at all? You need a bounce back, Jordan. You need a big bounce back, and that's gonna be pretty good. Yeah, that's gonna take the slope of the. You've cut the corner nicely, but it's gonna be a longer second shot for you. Two forty-two. Definitely close enough to go for it, but whether you do or not, that's up to you. Got an iron in hand. Oh, he's taking out the big one. This is gonna hit the tree. Watch. Nope. Oh, that is 
what is it? What is going on with the AI, man? <laughs> the AI this video has been a showcase on what not to fucking do with the AI. On, like, just a showcase of the worst moments of the AI. Like, I generally think the AI have been a success, like, for me, personally, because I've really enjoyed playing alongside them for the most part, but this has been a disaster. I think there's been a disaster in this video. I'm gonna come back two clubs and put this into the middle of the green. I know that pin position is gonna be a... Uh, it still went up the back, actually. Jesus. Stop. Eagle putt. Another eagle putt, by the way. We've had eagle putts on every par 5 so far. It would be nice to make one, though, and tie the lead. The second at 13 at Augusta National. How do you do with that one? That was great, Rich. This is the most famous par five in, in the world. Eh, it's one okay, Jordan. Why, Honestly, you kind of suck right now. I'm not going to lie to you. The whole presents All right, 1.5 degrees Chains above. Away with an eagle. Aim like here. And I'm going to go foot up. 40. I'm going to aim just out there. Oh, perfect on the back. That's a chance. Wow, it's a tap in birdie. Ooh, it's a tap it's in nice birdie. It was a good opportunity. It was a good effort, and it's going to be a good birdie. Well Jordan Speed for par. Will be a bit of an around the world par here if he makes this, so let's see. Jordan Speed. He makes it. He makes it. Well done. What a par. <laughs> AI's putting when it's outside of one foot. Really good. But it's inside one foot. Just like that. Not good. Five under, baby. Come on. We're one we'll back, baby. We can finish strong here. We're in with a real chance to win this thing. Well, I mean, it's a long time to go left, but this I'm just saying, like, we'll be putting ourselves into contention to win this thing at least. Obviously, there's a uh, there's two days Looking after this one, strong but finishing kick here on this Friday to we'll be putting ourselves in position to do it. We can't win it today, but we can definitely take ourselves out of it, here. and we've uh, we've done a good job of putting ourselves into it more than more than out of it. I did say that I'd be happy to shoot like a four or five under round on Sim, but we're already four under. And we got five holes left. So, yeah. We're cooking. We're cooking, good looking. And good swing from Jordan there. He's left himself about 200 yards. Yep. Fairway, One ninety. Whoa! <laughs> Jordan with the... <laughs> from That's the hilarious. Fairway. Let's go to Noda. The most attractive feature of this hole is the dynamic What you got for me, Jay Spizzle? Cut into three separate sections guarded by an amazing false front where the ball oh, will yeah. come all the way off the Oh, fringe. yeah. Gordon Spieth, my man. Mm. Mm. That's good. We got that big false front. Of course, we don't want to be short. But I think if I overswing this one a little bit, this should be perfect. I underswung it. I underswung it. That's the exact opposite of what I wanted to do. I think we'll still get over. Oh my god, I might go in the hole. Oh, what a shot. Oh, yes. Oh, it's been a round we are on fire tonight. right now, man. We're going to win the Masters Championship here. Well, we could do. You know. We certainly could do. I didn't even know I could make that sound, to be honest. It's for birdie. Come on, what a birdie. Yeah, that's good putt. A birdie three in our last four. four. And we're heading to a par five as well, no less. This is the guy three in a row going to the par five and take the sole lead of this damn tournament. Or so I think, at least. Jordan's beat to stay at one under par. Just about. Song JM and Scott Stallings actually are seven under now, so we are not going to be solo leader, but we can be tied for the lead after this one. That's for sure. Let's head to Firethorn and hit a beauty. It has been the second easiest hole on the course behind only number 13 but it was lengthened in 2022 with an extra 20 yards added on making that potential carry over the pond with a second shot perfect draw that much tougher come on keep coming back to the left a little bit yes that's the bounce i needed no issues here couldn't ask that for a better bounce the there my friends that's absolutely brilliant now that pin there on the left hand side is going to be quite tough but um i i think that we can get this on and get it close he needs a good finish to avoid uh, taking himself into contention to miss the cut. Gonna be a layup from for Jordan from there, though. I'm just gonna skip that because looking for it's stupid. a strong fit. Thank you. He's, he, there's no way he's going for this shortly. I don't even think he's gonna reach the the water. Oh my God! What a shot! Fair play. <laughs> okay, I didn't think it was possible for him oh, to reach honestly from two right two eighties. I'm gonna hit the six iron. I know that seems short, but six iron high draw. 
Watch this. I'm giving it a watch this moment. Bro. Oh, this is gonna flirt with danger left. Oh dear, that's not gonna be. I'm enough. giving it a watch this right. moment. Into in front Stupid. of this 15th green. Clearly wasn't enough. Clearly wasn't enough. So now with the I thought it was, but I was clearly mistaken. Into this par five. I need a little spinner from here. I think spinner action is the one. I got to stop that. I'm gonna just play it a little bit short of that. Beauty. Great shot from there. We have a chance for a par still. It's disappointing to go in the water, but par here is fine. We'll still be in contention. Jordan Spieth with a long... This is going to go in the water. Somehow. I knew it was going to be over the back, no matter what, though. Their bunker shots are just... ass. Yeah, honestly, uh, this has been one of the most disappointing AI performances I've seen. And Fino is one we played with him. I don't know, maybe it's just Augusta they're terrible at? Was it Fino we played with? No, sorry, it wasn't. It was in Chambers Bay that we played with Fino and he was terrible. Well, it was awful. That's not his best, but it'll be quickly forgotten. We've had Frank, some, some definitely, it seems like they've got worse or something, well, I don't know. I maybe we've just had a bad dose. That's not even nearly enough. Wow, not even close. That was just an atrocious putt. Atrocious effort. It was way more than that. I should have realized that. That's stupid. Jordan for par. We're both putting for... No, I'm putting for bogey, actually. Gosh. Still have a tester for that bogey, too, you know. Oof. Gonna be a bogey for Jordan, too. I need to be aware now that it breaks more than that, so... Uh, Nearly missed that on the wrong side. That's a PBFU, my friends. Three holes left. And that's a, that's our first bogey. I was talking so much about bogey free throughout the round, and we bloody bogey the par five where we went for it in two and hit the water. I just came back too many clubs. I was thinking I really wanted to go out that pin and get aggressive with it. We were playing so well, but I got too aggressive. I got silly. 16, we can get it back here on the last three holes. Not easy to make birdies on the last three, but can be done. Of course, we know it slants in from right to left here. Wins with us. Yeah, I think I think I'm just gonna hit a high draw with this. Not drawing enough. Oh, that's awful, man. What the fuck is that? How does that even go that far? That's gonna be so tough from there too. Oh. Mm, that one. Speed's taking it right at it though. What a shot. Oh, great shot from Jordan. Yeah, he needed one. Shot, taking it in he right needed a great shot. He needed a great one here to avoid back-to-back -back bogeys. This is going to be difficult no matter what I do, I think. I need the spinner, and I need to somehow get this to stop as it hits that hill there. I need to just, cre like, honestly creep it on there with the spinner, even. It's a great chip. Great chip. Stop. Stop. Even with the spinner, that's just going to travel too far, but that's a good chance. We've given ourselves a good chance to make par. Yes, Jordan. Birdie for Jordan. He's back in the red figures now. After a birdie on 16. Fair play, buddy. I need to be careful with this one. This breaks a lot, you know. Yes, come on. That's clutch. That wasn't easy. I'll tell you, that wasn't easy. All right, 17 and 18 are tough. Honestly, I'll take getting into the clubhouse at 5 under now. We'll need a good moving day to get ourselves in contention, but sure. All right, my friends. Gordon Spieth has hit a good one there. Looking for a Only a three would actually. Stupid. On this Friday to get set up for the weekend in that another good drive here. Would we call that good though? Beautiful. Excellently beautiful. Uh, it all looks so simple. Beautiful, son. Beautiful. It? Be careful that you don't get this one straight up in the air from that line. Jordan Speed going way left. That's going to be a tough one from there for sure. It's going to trip, 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 trickle over the back. I was about to say cripple over the back. It's because I've been saying cripple so much because my bloody leg is crippled. Let's give ourselves a birdie chance here. Need a clutch part on the last one. It would be beautiful to make a birdie here. Come on, let's do it. A little high fade. I'll bring that back to like 182. Let's put this close. Come on. Yes. Let's be good. Long. That's awful.
Yeah, that's pretty decent from Jordan. That lady's not moving away from my bolo, is she? Gonna have to get out of the way there, lady. Thank you. They've cleared a pad for me now. I think I might hit a flop here because there's pretty much zero green to work with. So I'm thinking a little flop shot, put it close, and then walk off with a par. Oh, it's wonderful. That's a wonderful flop shot from there. Genius. It was the only way we could have really got that close, and we've nailed it. Absolutely nailed it. Jordan Spieth is going to hopefully get a par here. Is he going to get a PBFU? Oh, That's cruel. Right we'll tap it in. I don't know how his marker is literally half over the hole there. That's crazy. No problems there. That's a par. Par five under. So it's been a solid round. Just that bogey on the par fives killed me. Really, we'd be solidly up there if it wasn't for that. I mean, we're still up there, but we would be literally one, two shots back. Jordan Spieth aiming right for a one-inch putt. Off for bogey here at a bogey for Jordan. Bogey birdie and bogey for Jordan. He's back to level bar. He's going to need something. Just He's going to need something at the last, or he could miss the cut here. Jordan, I think the cut line's level par. He needs to make sure he gets a par or better here on the last, or he's going to miss the cut. That would be crazy if Jordan missed the cut while he's playing with us. Shoot off the tee, and it is steeply up the hill. Good drive, though. Puts you in position to maybe make a birdie. Yeah, perfect. Clip. Mm, okay. Should be a okay, I think. I don't think we'll have tree trouble there. I hope we don't have tree trouble there. Because the punch shot's really difficult from there because just of the slope that you have to go up. That line's plus one again, so Jordan, even if he makes bogey, should be playing the weekend here at Augusta National. It's just been a bit of a topsy turvy day for Jordan. It started absolutely horribly. He brought it back, and then he's had a couple of silly, silly bogeys since. But overall, I'll say, Looking for a I think you deserve to make the cut. Here on this I think you deserve to make the cut, the Jordan. Let's see what you got, baby. A little, a little smile, a wry smile from Jordan now, there up the hill, on the last the hole. At 18. Let's see if he can, uh, if he can give himself a birdie chance. Where's the pin at? Oh, I like that pin position. It's in the hole. Oh my God, what a shot! That's gonna come back down. That's for sure gonna come back down a little bit. And Jordan is going to have a really good opportunity for birdie here on the last. Get back under par. Well, I, I think I don't that have any tree trouble, thankfully. From the fairway noted, I think we're close enough where second. we don't have tree trouble. He's looking at 141 yards. Right, I'm gonna to hit the this. Front, I know that might seem crazy, but I'm gonna hit this. Hole, Just because of the uh, the, the nature of the uphill right shot here. Green. Needs to push more. No, push less, please. Oh my God! I feel like this is my first bunker shot today. I've been I've avoided the bunkers so well today, but we've left ourselves a really difficult one here now. Flash it out, let the ball run towards the flag. Really hard to do, I might add. Oh, it's played brilliantly. All right, we're gonna finish with a par. Oh, that is very. We can't well say no. I said four under, five under. I'll take shot. it. And that's exactly what we've done. It's just under the circumstances, it's a little bit more disappointing than I would have wanted. But Jordan Spieth has a chance to get back under par here on the last, and he's he's got it. He's nailed it. Yeah, well done, Jordan. There, Three bogeys and today. a triple as well. So he finishes one over for his round. Okay, so that will wind up. And we finish four under round. for our round. We're in contention yeah. heading to moving day, my friends. A good moving day, and we could big time be in contention. But Matthew Fitzpatrick is starting to run away with this thing here. He's ten under after two rounds. Sung J M, Will Zalatoris, Scott Stalling, Scotty Scheffler, all ahead of us. But uh, I think we'll probably be playing with Scotty Scheffler in round three. Let's see if we're playing with Scotty. Yep, Scotty Scheffler, round three. That's going to be a fun pairing, guys. I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. If you did, you know what to do. Drop a like. It's the best way to let me know you enjoy this content. We'll be back with Moving Day at the Masters in the next video. And uh, thank you for all the support on these Masters videos so far and the career mode videos in general. It's been absolutely epic, and I'm really enjoying making them. So I hope you guys are enjoying watching them as well. See you next time. Pleasure to serve you all. Peace out. Break.